Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. How are all my adventurers doing? So, first off, before we even start this video, I was gonna say, Hey guys, welcome to the second series. But, apparently we just couldn't decide on that. <laughs> I kind of figured that this was probably gonna happen. But, interestingly enough, the last three days I've been setting up, trying to get a second series going along with Octopath Traveler. Because I am ready for that now. I just kind of stopped on Octopath Traveler. Just because I wanted to get everything ready for the second season. So I could just go back and forth and you know, record everything. So the first pool was basically. What type of genre did you guys want to see as a second series? As you can see it started off you know pretty even. Then out of nowhere survival came out on top. Then I asked if you guys wanted to be surprised about the survival game or did you guys want another poll? Then, you know, I gave you guys the option between five games and, you know, out of nowhere, just we just split even. <laughs> but I shall break the evenness of this. It will no longer be up to you now. It shall be up to the spinning wheel of fortune <laughs> that's how this will be decided darn it <laughs> we, we've gone three days of polls also if you guys want to join the polls and get notified um, that there are polls <laughs> make sure to follow the discord or jump into discord why did i say follow the discord well, technically you can't follow Discord, but yeah, jump into Discord, you know, every like, I think a month, I'll be doing like a new series if one of the series are done around that time. You know, I'm kind of mostly doing the second series just because I can't just sit there and upload only the Octopath Traveler. Because <laughs> that'd just be awkward, but... You know, we're ready for the second season. Let's see how how this wheel just chooses our fate. Could be Minecraft. Or it could be Cinebel. Let's see which one it shall be. This is the future of the second series. And it's Cinebel. Well, I guess we're doing the Citadel series. Feels bad for anybody who wanted to add Minecraft. I had had something special planned for that one, but you know, it feels bad. You guys had your chance. You completely had your chance. And now we're playing Citadel. <laughs> All right, let's jump into it. Okay, I changed all the settings to mostly things that will tame. Really? <laughs> That will tame everything. Because I don't know why this was up to like times three and stuff like that. So I feel like this is going to either be very tamed or either I'm going to have a really bad time. But if you guys don't know anything about Citadel Forged with Fire. I'm going to let Z explain that. But I say if you guys don't know who Z is, you're going to have to go all the way back to our Indie Game Sunday. She's our new mascot. That explains basically the synopsis or, you know, it somewhat interacts with the series now and then. That's it. Z, go ahead and get them the rundown while I get in game. Citadel Forged with Fire is a massive online sandbox RPG with elements of magic, spellcasting, and interkingdom conflict. As a newly minted apprentice of the magic arts, you will set off to investigate the dangerous world of Ignis. Your goal, create a name for yourself and achieve notoriety and power among the land's ruling houses. You have complete freedom to pursue your own destiny, hatch plots of trickery and deceit to ascend the ranks among allies and enemies, become an infamous hunter of other players, build massive and unique castles, tame mighty beasts to do your bidding and visit uncharted territories to unravel their rich and intriguing history. The path to ultimate power and influence is yours to choose. Okay, thank you Z. Appreciate it. So, first off, 
I just created my character. There is not a lot of character customization in this game at all. There's only literally four faces and four hairs, unfortunately. And the four hairs look pretty terrible. I'm kind of curious, will this game have mod support? Because if it has mod support, there, there would be so much more to offer. Because I know a lot of modders would just destroy the hair system, face system, and, you know, the overall quality of the models and everything. Uh, that much I do know. Alright, Adventurer Wolf is ready to go. And let's get into it. No. Oh. Okay. So they don't like spaces. Good to know. Oops. They're just like, ah, uh, what's that space you put in there? So we can go to Rain Court, Arth, or we can go to East Reach. Ah, uh, I, I, li I like Rain Court. No, that one sounds like fun. Sounds like it rains here every day. If it doesn't rain, then it's a false advertisement. <laughs> Where's the rest of my body is what I should be asking you. <laughs> huh. Apparently I am Jesus. <laughs> I was just floating and now I, I can't see my legs. Unfortunate, dude. I'm not immersed. My immersion is now destroyed. <laughs> yoink, yoink. Yoink. I'm gonna yoink every last one of these crystals you have. Oh, there's wood here too. As well. Everything I do gives me XP. Okay, cool. Uh time again. Oh, you got quests, don't you? And this text goes a little bit faster. You're giving me a whole book case, aren't you? Oh my god, there's more. Okay, thank you. I was about to say, dude, what else do you have to say? So now we have to find cloth. Each player has an inventory that is, oh. Okay, so this is just a tutorial stone, noted. So cloth is made through ye yellow pine. Pop. How long does it normally take these? Okay, it does it one at a time, noted. How you how you're doing? You, your face looks very pixelated. You know that, right? Just a heads up. Oh, okay. I'm done with your quest. Hey, level up. Oh, now you're gonna get me to cook for you? Come on, now. This is. <laughs> I just came out of the forge and I'm already getting fucking labored. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> What's going on here? How dare you? But we are going to need to learn how to do the food thing, though. So we have our skills here. Oh, yeah. You can go ahead and, like, build, like, whatever you want in whatever way you want. I could go, like, a full damage build. Or I can go down the mage route. It just really depends on what I want to do. I could be a tank. Or I can be a wizard. I'm going to pick a wizard. <laughs> Just for the hell of it, we're going to pick a wizard. Just sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, we have extra skill points. Okay, it goes in down here too. Oh, so building comes into play. Last time I played this, I don't remember building or anything being down here. So that's interesting. There's potions that we can make too. Need it. Need, need, need. That's a uh, re die. Actually. Okay. <laughs> There's still potions we can make, but that's re die. <laughs> I would say we should pick up house things while we got the points. Just so we can build, like, a place to stay. Um. B. B is for the building stuff. C is 
for just whatever's in my inventory. <laughs> okay, noted. Alright, bro, we learning. We learning. You know, I clearly didn't learn how to make this damn food already. <laughs> Okay, so we have the ingredients for our berry. We need crowberry, ghost orchard, and mushrooms to make this. Okay, so place in creature storage to increase loyalty time by 20, 20 minutes. Okay, so taming's in the game. I don't remember taming ever being in the game at first. Okay, so what else do you have? Next up, we should cover. I'm probably gonna have Z read all this. <laughs> Just to put more work on myself, maybe. But this is actually pretty interesting. Like, looking at, like, all the things that have changed since I last, like, first reviewed the game. And considering the fact that her text is, like, literally moving down this box. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was kind of hoping this game would have voice acting by the time I uh, came back to it, though. That's the only thing I was hoping. Uh, if I remember correctly, last time we had issues of trying to find stone and shit. Uh, this time, I remember, we go outside, go to a beach or shore or whatever that has stones laying around. Or either it was sticks, I'm not sure which one it was. It was somewhere out there. Nothing hurt me out here, please. I'm just just looking for rocks and sticks. Might as well pick up some of these shrooms since it makes our uh, food. Oh, I, I got startled because I thought uh, I was in battle. I thought something hit me for some reason. I was just like, oh shit, well, I'm dead. <laughs> Oh, uh, there's a skeleton boy in front of me. What the fuck, dude? Ah, run! This is my, this is my running. This is me running, guys. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, God, I can't even jump either. <laughs> Just a random skeleton waiting on me out there. Dude, I can't even get to the water in order to find my rocks. That, and that's the hardest difficulty. Finding the rocks. <laughs> do I lose everything? Oh, I do. But I don't you lose my level or anything, so that's fine. Everything else we can collect pretty easily, just because these are just sitting out here. <laughs> Plus the sticks are sitting out here. Oh, stone. Okay. My special self. I, I didn't learn from the first time that I uh, did this, that stone was in here. I didn't even bother to even look down. I, I saw that there were sticks in the woods. Uh, you know what? Fuck you. Don't. How dare you even justify that I'm blind. <laughs> Especially when I didn't even know. <laughs> I might as well just pick up everything here, dude. Shit. Fuck it. And you give me achievement? How dare you? <laughs> we're, we're just gonna pick up all this just so we don't have to come back later and just suffer for looking for rocks ow my eyes okay yeah stop flashbanging me please we shall build our first one staff we'll, sooner or later so this gives more loyalty doesn't give us the what it needs early unfortunately Ooh. okay uh, staff or wand? Staff. We do need a door. Stairs would be lovely. Along with the roof. What's this? Oh, this is a fire pit. I definitely need that. I feel like I might have thrown the point system up too much, but then again, it it was at like a um, I think times one or two. I'll have to go back and look. 
But then again, there are a crap ton of skills. I mean, yeah, crap ton of things in here to upgrade. Huh. I feel like I'm gonna have to turn that down for sure. I think that's just the logical choice of that. I'm done with your quest. Okay, so what do you want me to do now? Craft a haste spell? Okay. So, let's see. Okay, here it is. Craft spell. Use haste spell. Okay, so what else do you have? Okay, so you're gonna give me a wand for extract magic. Okay, so that's what we do. We take this whole nature thing that we were just received and we drag it inside of here. And now we get a new sorts of spells. Is there a dash attack? Through a crowd that gets through defenses. Okay, a geyser. Armored skin, and that's what that is. Oh. This is definitely very trippy. I'm just going to say that now. It's like extremely trippy. Spells is going to be quite something. Hey, Ma. Mom. Dude, I got the spell. It just took me a while to figure it out. <laughs> now there's a light spell. Oh, God. You got another quest for me? Extract spell. Extract the uh, wood. We already did that. There we go. What else you got, Mom? Mom. What you got? Build a fire pit. Uh, I think we have a fire pit. Uh, let's go into mana one more time, then we go into damage. More damage, dude. That's the true mage way. <laughs> oh, rings. One ring that gives crit chance, the other one that gives armor. Well, if anything, this is going to be making the series more interesting with all those skill points being available. Just because I think I'll be able to progress a lot quicker within the series. Instead of just, you know, sitting at a boring point for you guys. So what does this one give? This one gives a healing spell. Ooh. Leeches enemies HP. That's interesting. So, how do I use the axe without the skill, though? That's that's the thing, because I have to take this off in order to do anything. Can I, like, take it and put it in here and just save it or something? Yeah, because if I do that, I, I have to do this again. Or do I just take off the axe instead. No, I can't take off the axe. Huh. Well, that's disappointing. Because <laughs> I would literally have to replace a skill. So I can only hold one skill on this axe. Okay, then. That's the thing. Is it on this axe itself? Or is it on a deer? Ah, it is. It is. So what I place on one of my weapons is what stays on that. That's interesting. And I like that. 
Okay. So, for the wand... I know I definitely... Oh, the wand has different abilities. From what we uh, originally had. Because this one has the blast and storm. And this one has the beam and missile. Dude, that's actually pretty interesting. So that means that this light spell should have different ones too. Okay. If it would just stop. Okay, there we go. Now let's look at it. So this one heals. Oh. So look, convert your mana to HP. So what about this one? A wave of roots from the ground throws your enemies aside. That one sounds interesting. I want that one. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay. We're wizard Aries. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Aries. We got this now. We already learned our first spell. Where's when Guardian Leviosa? I need that one. <laughs> so, can I change? The no, I can't move it to the other side if it was like bothering me on which side it is. Which is unfortunate. That's, that's the thing that uh, kind of makes me sad a little bit, though. This one gets projectiles. Uh, how long does this go on cooldown? Three? Uh, then... Really, beam would be necessary, really. Even though it's going to probably be really weird to aim, if anything. What did Mom want, to just want us to do again? <laughs> I, I, I wasn't thinking about it. Uh, whoa, wait, uh, it was B, then I went down to magic, this, then fire pit. Mom. Mom. Mom? You're gonna make me build outside, Mom? What the fuck, Mom? Mom, please. <sighs> Damn, I gotta build outside somewhere. Since it's a no-build zone. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Uh, the Mom, it's still... Still no build zone out here. Help. Help. Okay. Well, it, it's dangerous out here. I'm coming back in. Apparently, uh, she, she is going to teach me where to build these things. <laughs> this is a no build zone. Wait, don't tell me I have to be like extremely far away. Is it kind of like dark and light to where you have to be like a certain distance away from a town to be able to build? I hope not. I think it is. Holy shit, dude. How far of a no-build zone do you want? Well, I at least I... Yep, yep. It's, it's exactly like Dark and Light. You can't be a certain, like, distance close to the fuck... Okay, you know what? Whatever. Whatever. What ifs, you know? Shit. Bug it. This <laughs> is... Are you kidding me? Mom, what the fuck, dude? She just sent me out here on my own. She was just like, dude, I'm, I'm already sick and tired of you. <laughs> She's probably just like, stop calling me freaking mom. <laughs> I'm not your damn mom. She doesn't understand, dude. She was the first one I saw, so I'm automatically already imprinted. <laughs> so she has to accept it at this point. I mean, there's nothing else for her to do anyway, so fuck it. Just, just accept the situation that you've gotten yourself in. What are you going to do? Move from that spot? <laughs> Not going to be happening. Uh -huh. Huh? Oh, I actually didn't level up that time. So level's going to be getting a lot steeper. So you want me to build... Uh, we'll cook salted boar. Let me guess, I need the Flames of Justice for it? Yeah, Fire Pit. Uh, where is it, though? Uh, did I pass it? 
Oh, there it is. Salted boar. I have everything I need. I'm going to go ahead and change back to haste. Just because that seems a lot better. <laughs> Especially getting around. I think that's just the smartest idea. This is going to be a fun little series. I can't wait to suffer a little bit inside. <laughs> But I'm also interested to, like, start taming things, too. Just sounds very interesting. I'm sure magic's not the way to go about it. Just, <laughs> just you know, basically kill things, wouldn't it? Because it's not a blunt weapon. Also, where's my fire? Oh, I was about to say, dude. Just... Okay, just making sure it's salted boar. You know me, I can easily forget and just completely fuck up something. <laughs> This is me who we're talking about, after all. Wow, dude, it even floats up above it. <laughs> that, that's some magical campfire right there, if I tell you so. <laughs> Mom, I has the food. Mm -hmm. Stop making me cook for you, damn it. <laughs> Because that seems like what's going on here. You're forcing me to cook. Travel. Oh, interact with a travel point. Portal. I don't know what a travel portal is, mom. What the heck? Magic place. This town, for instance, is one of the three. Oh, so can I travel to the other three? Will I have to navigate the map for that? I'm pretty sure. Um... This bitch showed me and look at the map and I don't even understand what the fuck I'm looking at first off. <laughs> it's kind of like, what am I seeing here, mom? Like, the fuck? He's just like, hey, interact with a fucking travel portal. It's just me sitting here like, where the fuck's this? A wild mutant has appeared. Excuse me? Oh no, I'm in danger. <laughs> I don't feel safe anymore. Yeah, I definitely feel like I'm in fucking danger. Mom, uh, something has spawned and I don't like it. I'm going to end off here because now I'm scared. I don't, I don't know what's waiting for me outside anymore. And I, I feel like it's not good. It's just, oh, 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 no, my eyes. Okay. I thought I was staring into the bla into the, like the gates of oblivion, and this is, I already know what was gonna come through that at that point. I was just like, ah, well, I might as well just set my death. <laughs> mm -hmm. What else could you possibly want, Mom? Uh, you want me to talk to someone? I'm guessing he's in a different place, huh? Yeah, he's. Probably all the way over here. Or somewhere. Huh? Serial complete. You don't want to talk to me no more about what the fuck, dude? He's like, I, I've prepared him enough for the world. <laughs> I want him out of here. <laughs> well, well, guys, it looks like we're on our adventure. Uh, <laughs> thank you guys for... Uh, thank you to everyone who's voted. This is going to be a little interesting series right next to uh, Autopath Traveler. With that said, <laughs> I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out. Was that a bear I saw? Oh no.